Okay, she's just stuck. It's ladies' night. Oh, oh crap, oh crap. Greetings, guys and girls and fellow gamers. My name is Games for Cakes, and welcome to the zombie infested world of Seven Days to Die. I have been out for the last day and a half overnight out there mining ore. So we have tons of ore. We got about 170 stone, which I turned to gravel. We had a little bit of gravel left. I made another forge because we are now making steel. We have to make steel because I want to upgrade. I want to see. The, po the poles I'm not too concerned about. It's the actual walls here that I want to upgrade, okay? The lower part of the walls. Um, and I suppose the zombies will be hitting the actual um, iron bars and all that. But I want to start using steel. So, and I have loads and loads of iron in that mine nearby. There's actually, um, the mine goes actually all the way underneath and then somewhere here into a big hole as well where there's lots of iron as well. And there's another mine actually here. Somewhere there and another one here. So it's loads and loads and loads of iron ore. Anyway, let's make, I think it's down here, is it? No? There we go, stealing it. And we're gonna put that in. And what do we need? It needs six, so it's just one. Oh, it's one of those. Okay, so we need five pair upgrade. And we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-nine, thirty. Wow, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six. Wow. Okay, that's pretty much everything nearly because six times five is thirty, and then yeah. It's 180. Wow. Well, there we go. That's gonna take some time. <laughs> Shit, that's gonna take seriously some time. Okay, how about we are not doing that now. We're gonna make a few more iron, uh, a few more steel. Wow. Oh, sorry. So we put a steel here, and put a steel here, and then I'm gonna take that and take Am I stupid now? Okay. There we go. Sixty sixty 60. That's very good. That's synchronized, at least. Okay, so let's put the rest in here. And we don't... We, we need these for metal siding, actually. We want to take these ones as well for some upgrades and metal siding. We want to take the pipes. We want to take these guys. We want to take uh, the other wood, 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 wood. Do we need concrete? No, we don't. We want to take the rebar frames. Hopefully we have enough. And we need the mix. And the, le the lead, we don't really give a crap right now about. Um, we leave that here, and we leave the oil up there. Brilliant. Now we have everything we need, and we're going to do some serious building in this episode. First, we're going to do some serious eating. We might as well take that just in case we're going to get surprised by one of our friends. Let's eat again. And I drink when I'm upstairs on my bike. Now, fire. Okay, I need my wood spikes. Where's my wood spikes? Where's my wood spikes? I had lots of wood spikes. There. We're gonna need to craft a few more. Here we go. No, 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 no. Wood spikes. Okay, so. How many do we need? Okay. 
There we go. Wow, that is perfect. There you go. So it's about 80. Yep. There you go. Eighty. Brilliant. Okay, so we have still a few woodlock spikes left. We're gonna No, actually we don't need to make more for now. We actually yeah. Okay. Brilliant. Okay, I didn't want to waste too much time. You can see what's going on up here basically, okay? So let me just I forgot to take my upgrade tool. Sorry about that. I'm gonna use that because we're gonna be doing a lot of um things and i want to have a drink and we're gonna have to cook some of those golden rod tea we're actually gonna do that right now there we go take 14 okay we have to make a pot oh i think we have a pot hang on Now, we will trigger probably a horde, but hey-ho, we deal with them as we get there. I don't want to lose that, so we'll put that in there. Okay, cool. Excellent. So, with, oh, without further ado, let's start uh, building. What we're going to do is we're going to build all the way around the wood, and I want to finish the metal trussing there as well, but mainly I want to upgrade all the wood and get all the wood planks laid, and, well, you know, we're going to do that then, so... Let's get started, I suppose.
and we are back now uh, it's gonna get dark so luckily i had loads of loads of ore to make torches which i made actually the night before before we even started here so i will just make sure i have light in all these rooms there we go because we want to work through the night if we can actually we could have just put in the lights actually here yeah that 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 that's actually works really well now what do you see here the reason i did this yeah i in the beginning you saw it wood everywhere okay and then i was thinking oh man that's not good because i can't shoot through that and if i get really into trouble down here i want to be able to uh, shoot through that so I decided, because I have explosive balls, for example, that I can just shoot through here and just blow the crap out of everything. Now, which also means I want to replace the ground, actually, with um, concrete, which is very hard and can't be destroyed. So we can do a little test now. So let's go... Yeah, we have a lot of light, so it's fine. And we have, a... we have this as well. So say, for example, I want to um, just get my concrete. Now, it is already 10 o'clock now, so we have to be careful. So, we have concrete here, okay? I went through all my iron bars nearly. Um, and this is now making the steel ingots that I need for upgrading my base with steel. Which is actually very good, so let's actually take that straight away. So I have this block here selected. Ah, I have this block here selected. Sorry about that. Okay, so let's do that, and let's make um, a few more pipes, so we can make um, the, uh, what is it called again, the repair tool, because for some reason the repair tool is the only one that you can use to upgrade um, this to steel, which is really weird. So if you look at that, okay, let's put a little bit of light in here. Okay, there we go, and might as well just put one here. Okay, is that bright enough? Yeah, that will do. Okay, so um, if you look at this now, we have... I'm going to put that down here so we see actually how much we have. This should go to 99 now, upgrading one. Okay, see that? Five. Now that should help because when the zombies come and let me just go through here now so we can see now from that side the zombies will stand on the spikes and they will hit the iron bars uh, on top all right but they won't get through because they that that steel should be very very hard okay now the other side um oh i thought there was something coming no Okay, we're on the wrong side, is it? Where are we? No, no, it is the right side. Where's my steps? Oh, here. I'm a blind bat. Okay. I'm trying to listen out. I had my silly humidifier um, ventilator on. Okay, so this is from when I took the wood out. So let's get rid of that. Okay, now what's going to happen is some of that is gravel and some of it is concrete, but let's test actually how hard concrete is. Okay, so let's do the concrete first. So, say I have the explosive balls here, the zombies come, and I'm going to go like this. Concrete broken, everything broken. Okay, now... Or oh, asphalt, sorry, asphalt broken. And a hole. And of course we're gonna have to repair this. But now, if we have concrete, and we take the asphalt out. Let's actually take that one asphalt out, because I want to see something. I want to look at the statistics. Oh! I didn't 
get an asphalt. I usually you get the asphalt residue. Why did I not get it? Okay. Can we see why we maybe should use the right tool as well? So let's see. No, not even dirt. Oh, wow. Okay, so they must have changed that at some stage that asphalt doesn't give. Unless road asphalt is different. I don't know. Okay, there's no other asphalt. Okay, that is really, really weird. Anyway, so what we can do is this. And now let's see. Actually, let's also upgrade this fully. Just to see the difference. There we go. Now, if we have that, and we go up here. If we shoot now at this, I wonder what happens. It still gets destroyed. Huh. Okay. What about... Um, yeah, if I take this, I think they turn back into blocks. Yeah. Okay. What about reinforced concrete? Because this is actually amazing, because this guy has a hardness of 12. Okay. And... This is reinforced concrete, I think. So let me just check. I'm going to turn the creative menu on for a second because I want to check something. Okay, I'm not going to use it. Don't worry about it. Concrete. So if we have reinforced... Is it reinforced concrete? Yeah. So that has a hardness of 16. Okay, so what we're going to do is... Let's turn it off again. What we're going to do is we're going to put uh, rebar frames here now. Okay, one, two, three, one, two, and that's it. Then we upgrade them. And see what happens. And we can actually already test it by, um, okay, I don't really, let's test it here where something is not going to collapse. So let's shoot an arrow here. Okay, that is good. That is good, because this actually is... Look at this. Two. Wow, okay, yeah, we're definitely going to have to make this ground here reinforced concrete. And what we're going to do then here with these guys is... That, oh, that's such a pity. If you actually look at the rebar, yeah, there's rebar ramp frames and there's rebar frames, yeah. Okay, we are getting visitors, so let me just get up here into safety. They must have heard the noise. I actually forgot I still had these loaded. There's another one coming. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. Okay, that seems to be a lot. Let's actually... Um... Okay, she's just stuck. It's ladies' night. Oh, oh, crap. Oh, crap. Run, run, run. Oh, crap. That was me getting too cheeky. And then getting stuck in a hole. Wow, okay. Thank you. It is ladies' night. Oh, what a night. Ooh, I take that lady. Oh, I... Thank you. And now let's go into safety of my house. Now, 
which means this reinforced concrete is good. Now, what I want to check again in the and just to see if I have to add an extra recipe for that. If I say rebar, do we have rebar corners? Like the outer rebar frames. Now they have only... Oh, no. No. Rebar frames? No, they don't have that. Damn it. That would have been really nice because it means the corners could have been made out of um, con reinforced concrete as well. Oh, look at that. Over there. You can only see that probably on the big screen. Let's see if we can get him. Nice. Oh yeah, I can't shoot through that, have to, but I can shoot through that, which is awesome. Wow, okay. There we go. Oh, they're hitting on my ramps from the inside. Bastards. Ah, so. Okay, so let's continue. Let's ignore them that they're there. It doesn't really matter in the moment, so we just want to continue upgrading this, really. So, let's... Concrete, what am I looking for? Wood frames, yes. We have to make lots more wood frames. Wood frames. And more wood frames. There we go. Okay, so here we have again um, one. Why does that require only one? One, two, one, two. But why is this then? Oh, okay. I actually didn't need that one. One, two. Oh, this one is longer. Oh, interesting. Why is this longer? wonder if this is longer as well, then. One, two. Yeah, it is, yeah. Okay, cool. Just, I thought for a second that I counted something wrong, which would have been awful. But luckily I didn't. So that's how I've done the other ones. And there we go. Excellent. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh, my apologies. Okay, so now. Now, this is going to get all closed up, because I actually want this to be my upper living quarters. And hopefully there won't be any puking cops that are going to ruin the show, hopefully. Because they always do, with their silly puke. There we go. Brilliant. Okay, let's just do this and this. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I don't have a nail gun actually on me. I don't know, I thought I found one. I don't remember. Excellent. Yeah, I just put that up so we have a little bit of light up here. I'm very considerate sometimes. Okay, steel crossbow bolt over here. Why does it not automatically m mount it? No, it's not mounting it. Stop having such a dirty thought mind. You don't mount a crossbow bolt. You pile them on top of each other. <laughs> Genie Mac. I should have a license for this crap I come out with. Um, shouldn't be allowed to talk. So let's again 
connect this. Okay. Brilliant. And then we have to connect it here. Again, probably two. Yeah. Now I only put two and not because of stability, but hey ho, it doesn't actually hurt to have the stability. Even though there's nothing below it, um, what I can do is I can extend it below if I need to, but um, come on, there we go. Nice. And that should actually hold. I mean, we should be able to build a nice um, place up here, you know, with some nice red wood, some nice kitchen units, things like that. Um, also, um, just to let you guys know, because we're finishing off now, um, the multiplayer for uh, the forest should have started already again. It should have been posted about two hours before this video. And that will go on all week, uh, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. And on Mondays, I will post Imperion. Monday, uh, Wednesday, and Friday, I will post Imperion. And Subnautica, I think we pretty much reached again the limit on Subnautica on what is currently there. We've seen pretty much all the biomes. We have played around with all the new tools. And um, unless they're updating the experimental branch again with more things, I don't think I'm going to be continuing Subnautica until they will. Subnautica is a nice one. Like, you always get about... Uh, you always get a good bit of episodes out. You get about 10, 15 episodes out of it every time they do a big update. But after that, Subnautica is not... A, a, I don't want to insult it because it's a great game, but it's not your your stock survival game. Like it is more a beautiful game for exploration and for single player. I could play it forever, but on camera on YouTube, I think there's a there's a point where you can't get as creative. Like like here, we can always build structures which are weird and different. Like in Subnautica, there's only so much you can build, and uh, it's mainly due to the fact that. Like, you don't have as much individual freedom in the block designs. And they don't really have much in the game except for a couple of monsters and um, non-lethal weapons. I wish I would have had lethal weapons. I could have used a lethal bloody weapon yesterday. Oh, man. Poor Bubbles. In honor of Bubbles. So, yeah, that's that. I just wanted to let you guys know that. All right, okay, so I'm going to leave the episode here. I hope you like the outpost we're building. Um, all this is just um, for stability. What this is actually mainly for is that we can run to and fro here to um, shoot at zombies if we need to. And we have a nice little defense area. Uh, but we also want to at the same time use this as a for living area. So that's where this comes in. There we go. And it's now just the right time. Ah, come on. And we're gonna upgrade everything else with iron on the outside. Actually, we're gonna do that now. Let's get the rest of the iron, uh, of the steel, and see what we can upgrade. Steel is so expensive, it's ridiculous. Um, let me just ah, get rid of the. I always press. I want to press one. Okay, we still have actually a few left, so we probably don't have enough yet. Okay, so. You see, you can't upgrade them with a hammer. It won't work. You have to use the repair tool. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did enjoy it, please, as always, kick the like button in the arse like the gaming ninjas you are. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. And until then, as always, feel spaz and happy gaming.